Did you know that the average person spends over 50,000 hours of their life manifesting things and getting basically nothing in return? I mean, how many times have you daydreamed about your perfect partner, your dream home, a big promotion, only for none of it to happen? I know I was in that boat for a long time. That was until I discovered the one manifestation technique that literally manifested a goal of mine in just three days. I'm serious. Only three days from thinking about something to having it in my hands. And get this. Stubbies have shown this method is 57% more effective than any other technique out there. When I first heard about it, I'll admit I was skeptical. I mean tapping on my face and body to manifest my desires? It sounded kind of weird and hokey, if I'm being honest. But my curiosity got the best of me, so I decided to give it a try. The method is called EFT tapping, and it works by clearing any negative blocks like fear or stress that are stopping your manifestations. I have to say, the first time I tried it, I felt an almost instant shift in my energy. And sure enough, just three days later, one of my goals magically appeared out of the blue. I was blown away. And I know you will be too once you try this for yourself. So if you're ready to finally start manifesting your dreams 57% faster, keep watching to learn how this crazy powerful technique works. You'll be thanking me later when it has you achieving things in record time. EFT stands for Emotional Freedom Techniques. It was developed in the 1990s by psychologist Dr. Roger Callahan, who was researching the relationship between the body's energy meridians and psychological distress. Through his work, Dr. Callahan made the fascinating discovery that by tapping on specific endpoint locations on the head and chest, you could stimulate the body's energy pathways and effectively treat emotional issues like phobias, anxiety, and trauma. The meridian system is based on ancient Chinese medicine and involves energy channels, called meridians, that run throughout the body and connect at certain junction points. Traditional Chinese medicine believes that when these energy meridians are blocked, it leads to physical or emotional distress. EFT taps into this mind-body connection by using one's fingertips to gently tap on meridian points while verbally processing negative feelings beliefs, and traumatic memories. Strictly speaking, EFT is not about the physical tapping itself. That's just a tool used to engage the body's energy system as a shortcut to psychological and emotional shifts. At its core, EFT is a psychotherapy technique that helps clear the disrupted energy within the meridian system that is contributing to issues like stress, fears, and limiting beliefs. By energetically unblocking these pathways through tapping, it becomes much easier for the mind to then release negative patterns and reprogram itself with more empowering thoughts and perspectives. Over the past few decades, hundreds of scientific studies have confirmed EFT's effectiveness at treating an extremely wide variety of mental and physical conditions, including depression, anxiety, phobias, PTSD, pain, and much more. In fact, research shows EFT can often achieve better results than traditional therapies like counseling or medication alone. This is because it targets emotional issues at their source within the body's energy system, rather than just providing symptom relief at a cognitive level. When your energy flows freely and unblocked once again, lasting healing naturally begins to take place. At its core, EF2 pairs simple fingertip tapping with spoken affirmations to clear emotional blockages from the body's energy meridians. But how exactly does this process create change? Let's take a deeper look. The meridian system connects over 360 points all over the body. Traditional Chinese medicine believes these energy pathways, also called acupuncture points, impact our physical and mental health. When meridians are disrupted or blocked, it can lead to distress. Scientific studies have validated this mind-body connection. Research shows that tapping these meridian points with fingers engages the body's endogenous opioid system, 
our natural pain-killing neurotransmitters like endorphins and encephalins. This alters how our brain and nerves interpret stresses and discomforts. Additional neuroscience has found that EFT reduces cortisol, the primary stress hormone. It also increases levels of serotonin, dopamine, and other feel-good chemicals in the brain. These shifts help explain how EFT gently and rapidly clears emotional troubles. By lightly tapping meridian points while verbalizing problems, it effectively clears disruptions in the body's energy flow. This reset allows deep-seated psychological and cognitive blockages to be reprogrammed in a state of relaxation versus fight or flight. Over time, thought and behavior patterns naturally realign with self-acceptance. Hundreds of studies support EFT's effectiveness for various mental and physical issues when consistently applied. The techniques have also been adopted within some conventional healthcare systems for quicker patient recovery times and reduced costs. When I first learned about EFT, I was immediately intrigued by the scientifically backed results people were seeing. However, being naturally skeptical, I wanted to try it myself before fully believing. So I decided my goal would be to manifest a simple wish for clear skies on an upcoming weekend trip. Each night before bed, I did a 10-minute tapping session. I began by acknowledging my fear of rain ruining plans, then lightly tapped the points while speaking positives like I deeply trust nature's seasonal changes. To my surprise, I felt instant relaxation during tapping that carried over long after. When the trip arrived, I was thrilled to see bright sunny skies just as hoped for. It was then I realized the power of this technique. Not only did my minor goal manifest, but a deeper sense of ease replaced formerly stuck feelings. I was hooked. Since then, EFT has become part of my daily routine. A few minutes of tapping can sweep stress away mid-deadline. It's been instrumental in work challenges too, like when I manifested a promotion in just two weeks thanks to being able to think more clearly. The progress feels very natural. It's not forcing positive thoughts, but rather gently clearing whatever is obscuring your highest good. Over time, layers of burden fade until living freely from within becomes second nature. I can't recommend EFT enough for transforming your life in big and small ways. To begin, find a comfortable seat where you won't be distracted. Take a few deep breaths to feel relaxed. Now identify an issue you'd like to work on. It could be stress, worry, fear, etc. Say it out loud. To start tapping, use the fingertips of your index or middle finger to tap the beginning point, which is the eyebrow above your nose. Tap about seven to eight times while saying your issue out loud, such as, I feel stressed about work. Move to the next point, the side of your eye by your eyebrow. Tap seven to eight times while repeating your issue. Then tap under your eye, under your nose, chin, collarbone, under arm in the same way. Now it's time for the reminder phrase or positive affirmation. As you continue tapping each point, say something like, even though I feel stressed, I deeply love and accept myself. Keep tapping through each point as you repeat this three times. That's one round. Do seven to nine rounds total taking deep breaths in between each round. Over time, you'll feel yourself relaxing. Stick with daily tapping sessions for two weeks to fully clear emotional blocks. Remember, be patient and gentle with yourself. The goal isn't perfection, but consistent practice. Let me know if you have any other questions. EFT is simple, and I hope this helps you get started on your emotional healing journey. I hope this breakdown of EFT tapping has you feeling inspired to try it out. Remember, the goal isn't perfection. It's about consistently making space for positive change, one daily tapping session at a time. Feel free to personalize your routine in a way that feels best for you. Be patient as you practice. Remember, negative thought patterns developed over many years, so rewiring takes consistent effort. 
But I promise that with time, you'll start to notice tension dissolving in your body and mind where it used to cling stubbornly. Troublesome situations will lose their charge as well. Most importantly, don't get discouraged if you don't see immediate results. Neuroplasticity research tells us that our brains are highly adaptive. It just requires repeated positive experiences to take root. Keep tapping through challenges while imagining your best self, and that version of you will inevitably shine through more each day.